Now to a CBS2 exclusive. It's an inconvenience that has lasted too long for some New Jersey commuters. Broken escalators at the busy Frank Lautenberg train station in Secaucus. CBS2's Meg Baker found out just how bad the commute is. Better have your walking shoes on. A New Jersey transit escalator in Secaucus Junction broken for months, sending people climbing about four flights of stairs. To run up and down them is ridiculous. People are getting hurt, and you never see progress. It looks the same all the time. It's been so long that a Twitter handle has been created for the four non functioning escalators. The big joke is like, when is it ever going to be fixed? Here's what it's like to be one of those commuters. I took my camera into the herd, a race up the stairs. I counted 44 stairs and spoke to people who say they only have a matter of minutes to make it to their connecting train, so running up those stairs can get quite aggressive. It's really inconvenient because it's like I only have two minutes to make it to my connection train when I get home, and sometimes I can't make it. Two maintenance workers were on the scene today. They referred me to New Jersey Transit Customer Service to get answers. We're not sure yet. Yeah. We're sure. still in the process of getting estimates and stuff like that. Is there a timeline? Uh, I, I'm working on that right now. Escalator expert Patrick Carr says normally parts would be held in stock for a quicker fix. It seems abnormal. You could definitely steal parts from one and put it on another if you had to at least to get one or two running. Because even if you had only one running, at least in the morning you'd have it running down in the evening running up so that you'd be able to get people in the station. The machine suffered significant damage from a fire in November and from the water used to extinguish the fire. New Jersey Transit says the parts come from overseas manufacturers and there was a lengthy insurance review. In a statement, New Jersey Transit says it was important for us to work through the insurance process to secure the best interests of our customers and the taxpayers. Fares are expected to go up 9% next year, but right now, still no word when this mess will be fixed. In Secaucus, Meg Baker, CBS 2 News. Well, we want to know if you have ongoing problems at your train station or mass transit hub. If so, we'd like to hear from you. Check it out on Facebook or tweet us with the hashtag Transit Trouble.